Welcome back to another reaction video here on my channel, Sam and CS. And on this reaction video, we're doing Ahsoka episode three. Now on this episode, we're gonna find out what happened in the previous one. What I mean by that? I saw Ahsoka as being kind of men mending fences. Now they're officially Padawan and Master. What's gonna happen next? And what's gonna happen with that uh, map that they found between Morgan as Morgan Esbeth and Balin Eskal? Are they gonna find Thrawn in this episode? Are we still gonna get more mysteries solved? Probably. We're gonna find out in this episode right here. If you guys got any comments you want to leave, please make sure you leave the comments in the comment section below. If you guys want to follow me on all my social medias, please do so. My handles will be in the description for you as well. And always forevermore, you beautiful, lovely, gorgeous creatures, hit that like button and subscribe to my channel, Sam and to see more fun, awesome videos like this one that we're going to see right here, right now. And with all that being said, let's get into this episode right now. Here we go, part three. Going into hyperspace. Here we go, here we go. Sabine and Soka. Oh, here we go, training. We're training again. Oh, just like how Kanan taught her with the stick. With the bow staff. Very Japanese style samurai kind of look. I like the, I like the, I like the samurai style kind of aesthetic feel they're giving. She was doing good for a little bit, doing good for a little bit, and you know, Ahsoka's a master for a reason. Anger and frustration are quick to give power. But they also unbalance you. <clears throat> Let's go again. Oh, who's this? It's New Republic boys? Looks like New Republic, yeah. Oh wow, okay, this is a whole, this is a whole fleet. General Sandula? Chancellor? She's waiting. Chancellor? Where are we getting Mon Mothma? Hey, we got Mon Mothma, okay. Senators. Hera, you look well. How's young Jason? Jason! Chancellor, in fact, he's on board. Jason's on board? How old is Jason at this point? No doubt. Most likely. Forgive me, Madam Chancellor. <laughs> but if we could just hear the general's report, we're late as it is. Quite right. Wait, you say Jabba or Chapa? Did you say Jabba? Wait, hold on. Okay, sorry. We'll get to that point. The attack on the Vesper led me to the Sante shipyards on Corellia, where I was attacked by Imperial loyalists still working for Morgan Elspeth. Outliers. We have former Imperials working throughout every level of the New Republic government, and they've all taken an oath of loyalty. Long live the Empire doesn't sound like the kind of loyalty we're looking for. Yeah, that's true. What do you got to say to that, huh, Fussy Punts? It was my understanding hmm? Fussy Punts? The were arrested, and the facility shut down pending further investigation. Yes, but I believe their activity speaks to a larger operation. Mm. Involved yep. Uh, Grand Admiral Thrawn. Yep. But how is that possible? He disappeared years ago. I have reason to believe he's alive. And that his allies are working on a way to find him. You are certain of this? If I could get approval to send a task force to the Denav system, I could find out. General, be honest. Isn't this just another attempt to gain New Republic resources to aid in what has ultimately been your personal don't, quest to don't. define Ezra Bridger? Oh, come on. Ezra don't be like that. Thrawn. You and dick. Use a threat of Thrawn's return to acquire those resources. You that dick. A more practical purpose. I hate you already. I don't like you. Republic. I don't care what the people say on the internet, if he's right or not. He's a dick. I don't like him. No. Yeah. A few man. Just sat back and waited to see who came out on top. Pretty much, yeah, that's what he did. That's probably what most of them did. That's probably what you did too, huh, Mom Mothma? Not saying that's right or wrong, but. General Sindua, I'm sure we are all grateful for your service and role in restoring the Republic. Now, we as senators serve the people <laughs> of that Republic and senators. I can tell you, they want no part of any further conflict. You act like we have a choice, don't we? Yeah. I see no enemy. 
The Imperial fleet is scattered and broken. They have no centralized command. Unless Thrawn returns. Make your point, General. Jesus Christ, I hate this dude already. Thrawn is not your typical Imperial officer. No, he is not. I know because I fought against him. Mm-hmm, she did. He beat her a couple times, too. He killed friends, people who were like family to me. <sighs> yep, mm-hmm. R.I.P. Kanan. Listen. Come on, Yang. We need support here, not criticism. There you go. Let Sabine take the lead a little bit. Let's go. Come on. Hey, she's a Mandalorian for a reason now, okay? She knows how to fight. She knows how to be in the dog fights. There we go. Come on. That's a maneuver. Knock him out. Not Ezra. There you go. Seven ten split. One and knock them one down. Teamwork, baby. That's all you need. Oh, you still got three. Uda. About to see what they've been up to. Yep. It's the eye. I would say it is some sort of hyperspace ring. I'd like to confirm that. It's the eye. The eye of Mordor. Not the eye of Mordor. But their eye of Mordor. They're entering your center. I'm surprised you let them get this far. Stay clear. I shall deal with them. Prepare turbo lasers. Turbo lasers? Not just lasers, turbo lasers? Damn, Thrawn has been busy. Oh god, I swear to god that better not be Ezra. I swear to god that better not be him. It's not him. Man, the zero gravity is not going to be her friend. <laughs> oh, there you go. There you go, Soka. You got him. Oh, 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 cut it in close, cut it in close. Oh, my God, this is getting intense. Near death experiences. Always so fun. I love this rain red rainforest here. Kinda has like a power down. I protest, I have a lot of work to do. Standard Jedi protocol. I suppose that's true. Shutting down. <laughs> Heed your own advice, Yu Ling. I'm probably saying his, wrong, his name wrong so many times in this. I apologize to all my Star Wars fans. Hide in plain sight. 
easiest way to do it. Any sign of them? Nothing. They must be hiding in the forest. Let's regroup. Yeah, why not? You made it this far. Thank you. Are you all right? I haven't seen those creatures since the day Ezra disappeared. Uh. Anything interesting? Indeed. It's all meaning. The good news is the enemy vessel is still under construction and not yet complete. There are okay. some hyperdrive engines in place, with the final one being set into position. So it is a hyperspace ray. Yes, but I have never seen one built on this scale before. A craft with these power levels and configuration would be capable of a hyperspace jump of astonishing speed and distance. Yeah, and could a ring like that make a jump to a neighboring galaxy? Theoretically, if one knew the coordinates and navigation, yes, I believe it could. The Jedi archives speak of intergalactic hyperspace lanes between galaxies mm. that used to follow the migration paths of star whales named Purgle. Star whales? Purgles. Really? <laughs> so that's where Ezra went. Literally to another galaxy. Oh wow. They have more followers. Jedi have taken refuge in the forest. Hunt them down. He's done. Each other. Well, they're not they're not limited to resources, that is one thing. Dun 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 Obviously, a much shorter episode than we were probably all expecting, especially for an Ahsoka Star Wars show. But, you know, based on the title, Time to Fly, it was pretty much a dogfight kind of feel in space. And it, it's fun to see those. And we got, we got a lot of reveals. Obviously, we got the Chancellor Mod Mothma. It's not Chancellor Mothma. And pretty cool to see. Pretty awesome to see in live action. We saw Jason Sindula finally here in live action. That was so awesome to see. And you finally get to see kind of the the folly of the New Republic. Just thinking, oh, all these new Empire guys, they're not here. They're all gone. They're not going to cause any problems. Well, you dummies, because you decided not to do anything. They all decided to rise up because you didn't sniff them out when you needed to. That's what happens when you don't deal with Nazis right away. They'll still come out of the workshop. But, you know, I, I know a lot of people are going to be out there bitching and money, but you just too sure. But you know what? I am in the mind of if, if I enjoy it, if I had a good time, and I did. It was pretty cool. A lot of little lore, a lot of little bit of this, and I had a good time about it. Now, obviously not everything about it was pretty fun or anything, but you know, we're not here to talk about the bad things, we're here about here for a good time. And that's what we got here. And let me know what you guys think. Again, leave a comment in the comment section below. If you guys want to follow me, all my handles will be in the description below for you as well. Make sure you hit that like button. Subscribe to my channel to see more reactions like this. See my past episodes of Ahsoka as well. And until next time. Bye.